Hey, what's up everyone? Dark Sky here, and we are playing Creatures of Ava, the continuation. And we have uh, crash landed on this planet Ava, and we are working on trying to save the creatures of the planet. And hopefully the Nam as well. So uh, let's get into this, huh? So right now what we have to do is we go have to go talk to Namar, which happens to be an archaeologist that we met in a cave that we fell into by mistake. And uh, so we're going to go talk to him right now. So let's head that direction. So we got some like crazy little critters down here. These guys here like using their flutes to move people around. It's kind of neat. Or not move people around, but to uh, move the creatures around. So we need to come up into this area up here. Talk uh, in the mar here. Namar, oh. find your human friend, Strong Legs? Mm -hmm. Sure did. Huh. Hey, weird question, but do you know any good shepherds? That's not a weird question. And yes, I know Sebti. They live in the hills. Great, gotta go. I've got a job offer for them. Wait, wait, wait. Take this. A flute. Um, thank you. The Nam Shepherds are a bit aloof. To get their attention, you sometimes have to be a little creative. Uh, these ancient uh, beings you mentioned. Uh, the Antares? I've been studying them my whole life. So these Antares, they were an advanced civilization? You might say that. Most Nam would say they were thoughtless. I have my own theories. Oh. What even is this Navatar and how does it work? Oh. That's what I'd love to find out. Maybe if we... Uh, you know what? Never mind. Ignore my ramblings for now. Everyone else does. All right. I guess we're going to ignore that. It looks like something belongs here. I don't know. Maybe we need to find that, huh? Press three to play the flute. Okay. Hey, that's cool. I can play a flute. All right. So now what we need to do is it looks like we need to head this direction. It almost looks like we're heading back up to our house. Kind of, sort of, maybe. Uh, let's see here. We got some petals to pick. What is this? New item discovered. Okay, cool. Cool. What's all this? That's neat. Crazy looking thing, isn't it? All right. Uh, here's some more of those crazy things to pick up. Let's go into this, I'm thinking. I think we took a picture of those things already. thinking maybe that guy up there huh yeah i can't get through that yet <laughs> looks really funny when they climb the stairs like that what is up here anything worthwhile that looks like we could jump over here i don't know All right, let's see what this guy has to say. Septi, excuse me, are you? 
Hmm. What was it Nam said? Be creative. What is that noise? <laughs> mm -hmm. Vic, uh, pleased to meet you, Subti. So the human is back. Please do us a favor and don't breathe into that flute ever again. Harsh. Look, Septi, my friend and I need a shepherd. We want someone to guide creatures into our... The creatures of Ava trust only in its songs, and a shepherd trusts only in the creatures. Do you understand, human? Hmm. All right, guess I'll just walk around playing random notes on the flute then. Bye. Wait, wait. Um, kind human, there is no need for us to quarrel. Maybe we can help after all. Hmm. Great, come with me and we'll... Most humans are subdued by their own minds. Huh. Um, if you could... It is a clamor that drowns out all else, the din of their thoughts, their worries, their past. The flute, take it in your hands. Calm the tumult of your mind and learn the notes of the soul. Hmm. Much better. Every part of Ava has its song, Jungle Swamp Dunes. The tune you have just learned is the song of grass. Great. The creatures of the grasslands will now speak to you. But to earn their trust, human, you must learn to speak back. So he plays some tune, some notes, it looks like. Uh, it says, tame wild creatures by imitating the sounds that they make with your flute. Getting too close to the creature will scare them. The creature is singing. The creature is waiting for you to repeat the song if you get this little icon. If you get this little icon with a question, the creature didn't understand you. Uh, press three to play your fruit, move to decide which notes to play. Okay, all right. I didn't see what he did. Oh, okay. Oh, I got it, even though I messed up. Okay. The Ura trust you. How are you feeling? I feel strange, lightheaded, focused, but calm. Breathe, feel your feet on the soil. This next part may not feel natural to you. Uh oh. Okay. Play the song of grass. Concentrate. Hear Ava. Feel Ava. See Ava. As the creatures see Ava. Ah, uh, see. Hold to see through Ava. Oh, okay, cool. And then connect. What? Oh, that's cool. I'm controlling this creature? No! The Yura controls ah. itself. You only feel its sense of being as your own. But we of Ava help one another. Often our desires align. <laughs> yeah, I just did that. That was cool. 
Now bring the aura to the barn. Is this the barn over here? We have taught all we can. Thank you, thank you. I have no idea how useful this, this will be. You have no idea how useful this will be. <laughs> I read that wrong. Uh, we are just glad your music has improved. And remember, with Ava's song, the notes are beautiful, but the song is born with from the rest between the notes. Now, go away. <laughs> go away. How, how nice he is. Hey, Dad. Things are finally looking up. Anam agreed to corral creatures for us. Better. They taught me to do it myself. With music. What? <laughs> I'm a regular Pied Piper now. An artiste. You're crazy is what you are. But look, if it works, then whatever. I've dispatched the first set of rescue bots. Try leading some creatures into the bots' capture perimeter. A test to see if they're working. <sighs> you know how cheap these things are. Okay. So these bots that she's talking about... You're gonna like uh, use the little songs to kind of bring the uh, the the creatures in to the towards the bots, and the bots request require uh, so much uh, of a certain creature, or you know all that. So you have to kind of like uh, pay attention to what you have for surroundings and try to uh, get the creatures to uh, go towards the robot. Oh, through your uh, musical notes and all what that fun, fun stuff. So. so, okay, so there's a robot over there. So I'm thinking we need to get down there. So we're going to just head down this way, I guess. Activates from the other end. Okay, well, that makes sense. Let's jump down there. Looks like we got some fun stuff here we can pick up. Some over here. Can we pick up these? No? Okay. You will find Ava's creatures in three different states, friendly, wild, and infected. Friendly creatures trust you, let you pet them, and follow you if you play the flute. Wild creatures may run away or attack you. You must tame them with the flute to make them friendly. Infected creatures will attack you. You must remove the infection to make them friendly. You can... Shepherd friendly creatures by pressing three to play the fruit. Okay, yep, that's what we're doing. Yeah, isn't that cute? Look at that little guy. Huh? All right, so I'm thinking what we want to do is before we take this guy up and introduce him to the robot, well, the robot's actually on the other side. So what we're going to do is we're going to connect with this guy. And then when we're connected, we can do different things. Um, can't really climb. Can we climb up there? No, we can't. But there is something up there. Oh, that's that thing that teleports us back up. But like this here, we can mine this down. And that way it kind of open up a nice little area for us. So we're going to do all to disconnect from our little critter. And there he is right there. We're going to bring him into the rescue bot. So rescue bots allow you to teleport Healthy creatures to the bio arc. Lure healthy creatures inside the action area. Interact F with these rescue bots to teleport the creatures in the area. All right. So, and the bots also have like, you know, like I said, like so many creatures and all that do you need. So that one says, oh, we just need the one. So there's the one. So we're going to go up here and just teleport the creature. And there we go. We got her. So get over here and pick up some of these healing potions. That's always good.
creatures nearby. Four. Okay, there's four creatures nearby for us to uh, go pick up. Didn't see anything there. There was something back here. There was like some more healing potions and all that. I'm guessing it would be it might be a good idea for us to just pick up everything, right? Let's pick those up. We're gonna head back over here. And we'll climb up here. Imagine there's gonna be some some crazy nastiness. Oh, it's just flick the stick and you get it. Get the other guy in there. There we go. Got them both in there now. It's weird that the alt button is the... Uh, is like the run fast button. I think it would be easier if it was like the shift button. So it looks like we got some other stuff back here. Some new... New uh, plants, what not to pick up. They're out the uh, the wither blossom. There we go. That opens us up for down there. Okay, what? We just climb up this, I guess, and get up to the next spot. Wow, I actually did better that time. That was pretty nice. So, and then we can clear out this weather blossom here. And we have that thing over there to unlock. So let's use our flute here. And I'm going to use one of these guys to connect with. And he's going to go over here and help us knock down the bridge there we go and alt to disconnect there we go where'd, where'd the other guy go you should be already part way down here right there he is there's the little guy So we don't need to turn those in right away. We can use these guys here, climb up over here to grab these last two. Now we have all four of them, and we can go and do our turn in with the robot. So we got that knocked out. Uh, let's see here. We're going to go back over to this direction. And we'll use the zip line to get out of here. Okay. And then uh, let's see here. Where do we need to go? Looks like we need to go this direction, right? We need to meet Tabitha at the village. Okay. Well, that's easy enough. Oh, the wind chimes. Noms have built wind chimes all around Ava to show their love for nature. Take photos of them to document their traditions and earn research points. Hmm, so there's research points. Okay. I haven't learned how to do that yet, but we'll get to that point, I guess. All right, so from here, it looks like it's right around the edge. Here it is. All right, let's talk to her. Wow, Tabitha, you really made this place your own. I know. Cozy, right? 
Yeah, the flashing computers really seal the deal. We'll fit right in. Enough of your sarcasm, Missy. We need this equipment for research. Look at your PDA. You'll see what I mean. Okay, here's where we deal with the skill tree. All right, some actions reward you with research points that allow you to unlock new skills. Press the tab to open the skill tree. Okay. So here we are. We got this uh, little skill tree thing here. Uh, so one of them gives us like vitality, stamina, extra backpack, space. Uh, one does overcharge, beam, chained and unchained. And then item detector. Okay, that's cool. Concentration and rule. Uh, allows you to focus while using the camera, slowing down the time to allow you to take a better picture, especially useful with aggressive creatures. Oh, so you can take a picture of even the withered creatures. Oh, okay. I didn't even think of that. Uh, so how many points do we have? Uh, I'm looking here. Let's see. Oh, right here, skill points, so one. Okay, so we have one skill point we can use. We have two, we need two skill points to unlock these. One's to unlock these, one to unlock this. Two requires to not unlock this. Uh, let's do, I'm thinking that concentration might be a good one. Uh, let's do that one. All right, cool. So that should help us with focusing better, especially when we are uh, dealing with the uh, the uh, the withered uh, creatures, if you will. How's it going with the nun? They didn't give you any trouble. Why would they? I don't know. Chief Hanlo doesn't seem the welcoming type. Hmm. The last humans Aleph sent to Ava maybe didn't leave a good impression but we'll be different we're here to save them after all that's the thing hano doesn't believe me about the infection the nom don't want to leave so change the chief's mind play some of that fancy music serenade them i don't think my flute works on nom brains just talk to the chief you'll figure it out in the meantime, the creatures aren't protesting. Keep gathering them up. We're going to need creatures from all over Ava. Eventually, the jungle, the swamp. But for now, I'll dispatch more rescue bots across the grasslands. Whatever you do, don't send up any infect, inf <laughs> infected critters. That would be messy. Just don't do it. All right, so now we got to talk to the chief. Oh, I thought that was our buddy. The little archaeologist guy, but it wasn't. It's funny how the chief just stands here on a pole. Does he just stand on the pole here, like, all day long? I mean, man, he's got some, some strong legs, if that's the case. Uh, deepest, warmest greetings, Chief Hondo. Please just say hello, like a normal human. Huh. Right, hello, how are you? We are ruffled. Where once we saw one human, now we see two. Tampas has camp is harmless. But I get it, humans, we're sketchy. Maybe there's something I can do to prove I'm here to help. Hmm. All we nom think together. We feel Ava as a part of us. It's rising winds, it's setting sun, or at least most of us do. <laughs> he talks about the arche archaeologists. That's funny. Uh, we sometimes forget that humans, you don't understand us because you cannot feel us. Mm -hmm. Then help me understand. Help me feel. There is something you can do. It might make things between us clear. The non-settlements of Ava have been cut off from each other 
uh, for some time. But the withering, we want to send a message to the distant villages, an invitation to gather. The grassland Nam are throwing a party? We, Tamura Lan, would like to see our kin, yes. We hope that they will find a way here. Somehow. There is a ritual to announce this gathering. You've seen our village tree, yes? With the ribbons? It is a sibling tree. Three... Other such trees grow here in the grasslands, all with ribbons. Go to these trees. The Nam watches over each. Ask them to give you a welcome branch. We need these branches. They are our, how might a human put it, party invitations? Sounds important and spiritual. Once you have the three branches, take them to our nest ward, Oban. Is that like your child? Our nest ward, they will wait at the top of the tower in Oklahoma. Wow, some crazy words. Bring the branches, Odon, and we'll do the rest. Okay. If doing this will help gather all Nam in one place, that could make it easier for Tab and me to to nothing. I'll do it. I look forward to a greater understanding of your ways. Mm -hmm. Fondest farewells, great chief Hanel. Just say goodbye, will you? <laughs> so how does one give birth to a nest word? Uh, we beg your pardon? You know, Odon, the ward, you must have, you know, must have what? Please elucidate us? Like, was it, did you, how, how does a nom, yes? Never mind. <laughs> yeah, that sounds like a tricky question. I don't think I'd be asking them that either. Now, what can I find these sibling trees again? One tree grows in the east. It represents the Nari jungle, which grows beyond another tree, borders the Narubab swamp in the west. And the third grows south in the direction of the Antar Dunes. You said that Nam villages on Ava are cut off from each other. It happened long ago. The closing of the gates was a difficult time for many. The gates. You will see soon enough. We know this gathering of ours is unlikely, but Ava is in its golden autumn. If our kin can find a way here, it will make all the difference when the time comes. The time for what? I ask a lot of questions. You know that? I think it's a human thing. It's an annoying thing. <laughs> all right. So let's see here. We need to... Uh, uh, let me go that way. We need to find the western sibling tree. Do we really need to find the western sibling tree? Or just, like, start working on uh, getting these guys uh, rounded up? Uh, where was that robot? Oh, there he is. He's over there. Let's uh, run over here and see what these, uh, this robot wants. All the rescue bots are now in place. I'll send the list of creatures we need to collect for preservation. Let's do this thing. All right, rescue quests. The rescue of tomorrow grasslands. Each region of Ava has its own rescue quest, which tracks how many creatures you have saved in each species. To progress the story, you need to complete all main quests and rescue quests. Press the tab to see the rescue quest program. So quest available. Okay, so creatures nearby, signal too low. So we're currently at this one right now, and there's another one over here, and there's a whole bunch out here. Oh my gosh. How big is this map, huh? I don't know. This map could be huge. You just can't tell, you know? So we got a bunch of creatures, and see so here's a garage. Uh, complete four research tasks. 
We pet him, take a photo of infected crotch. We have not done that. So use the crotch, the co-op ability. Three and eight. And liberate crotch infections. We need to do like 14 of those, I guess. And rescue crotch species. Okay, so that's kind of neat. It, it has like little sub, uh, you know, quests in here. Uh, this guy here, we have to take a photo of it being infected. We need to pet one of these little guys. Huh. All right. And on this one here, we got to get infected. We got to pet. I thought I petted it. Or, uh, hmm. Maybe it didn't count. And then we have other, which I imagine are... Uh, the tree in the air, and then we have the Navitar. And it looks like we got a bunch of other puzzles we have to do. I wish you could just click on this instead of having to hit the backspace, because even the backspace sometimes doesn't seem to really work that well. All right, so we need eight of these guys. Um, I see there is, like, what, three of them there. And... I don't know if we can take any of those out of the stalls, but there is, I think, two of them over there. So I guess what we can do is first off is listen to what this guy says. Oh, there we go. We got three. So I'm going to the three in here. Teleport these guys. All right, now we need five more. Oh, we got a skill point from doing that, too. That was awesome. We got three more there. We got another two over here. Uh, Z. There we go. Now we got five of these, so that should finish this quest over here. All right, cool. Now all we need to get is 10 of these little flying critters. I don't know how we're going to get those. I don't even, I don't even see those. See a robot over there there oh there's some bird guys down there but that can't be right okay so here's the robot guy here so he says 10 of those critters nearby hmm I see those guys right there. That's like two. Well, I'll have to keep looking around a little bit. But anyways, I think this is probably a good spot for us to end this uh, episode. Uh, thank you very much for uh, coming along and joining me on this great adventure. It's been a lot of fun. I've really been uh, enjoying this game. This game is, uh, is really neat. I can't wait until it comes out. You can come join me if you like and uh, tell me about how, how it's going in the uh, comment section below. And uh, hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so already and smash that like. Also, you'll find more information down in the uh, description as well as where to purchase the game and whatnot. And I hope to see you on the next one. You take care now and bye bye.